Well, I'll be honest with you, today did not go as planned. Roll the intro. I got it! Okay guys, welcome back to the RC Clan channel. It's just me on my own today, which is kind of strange. I've not been out before. I just have me on my own. Usually I've got a child with me, one of mine. Yeah, I just get on with it. But it feels a bit sketchy today, a bit weird. I've never never done it on my own before. But I'm here. I'm taking out this bad boy, which looks absolutely terrible. I'm quite ashamed. But hopefully it should do should do pretty well. I'm hoping it does pretty well. But um, we've got the... Um, there we go. We've got it back up on there. And this time, I don't actually have to go straight. I've got a massive open car park in this ex Tesco's extra in Talbot Green. But yeah, it's absolutely huge. So I'm halfway. I'm going to do my best. I, I have, I've got something to admit, kind of. My GoPro is playing up again. For some reason, it won't turn on. I, don't, I don't think it's a battery problem because sometimes it will charge, sometimes it won't, and it's been a bit of a dick right now, and it's not charging. However, I'll set this up facing one way, and I'll get the speed run coming towards me so you guys can see it. But I might pass myself if I've got a good run. There is a bit of a bump here in the floor, just here. So I don't know how it's going to take that like, speed. But the overall car park is massive, and I sh I'm guaranteeing I'm beating 42 miles an hour today. If not, well, I don't know. You could think of something for me to do, but I'm quite excited. So uh, without further ado, I'm just going to set this up to video the car going, and I'm going to do my best to get over that 42 mile an hour. I really, really want to beat 50 mile an hour. So we're reading now. I'm gonna take it for his first run and we'll go from there and see what we get. Ready? First run. Right, so... See, I don't know if you guys are capturing this, but I just got an absolutely phenomenal run then. So, first little run. Here we go. First little run. Let's get that on. Stop. Read. Oh. 45 for the first little run. Let's go again. Let's try it again, see what we can get. I don't know how long we'll get before we get kicked off here. But I'm happy to wait until we do get kicked off. Now my steering trim. Okay, so I've just played with my steering trim. And that seems to be making not a lot of difference. And I've just binned it into the car. Oh, well, I'm so absolutely gutted with that. I um, I was expecting a lot more. And I am, I'm gutted because I hit the bump right next to it. It's my own fault for driving it so fast near the car. But I expected a lot more than that. And I'm really gutted, especially for you guys. I broke it now. On the top of the arm, the actual tower, the tower's smashed. Well, the brace that holds the uh, the top arm on. 
that's connected to the towers on the back is, is shot. So I'm done now, that's it. Game over. And um, hopefully, hopefully, I'll get it fixed though and we'll come out and beat it here because this is a good spot. I'm just gutted because it was such a good day for it. It was dry. And through me being a bit careless really and a bit, well not, well not, just, just not, um, yeah, just being careless in general. I've binned it right next to my car. I should have been doing it a bit further away. But lesson learned, it's my first few speed runs. And um, let me get back in a better light. Yeah, it's my first few speed runs. So uh, after a while, maybe I'll get the hang of not getting excited and just moving it away from the, the stuff that can damage your car. So if you haven't subscribed, please do. Make sure you do. I'd really appreciate it. And uh, yeah. I hope you enjoyed the video and like I said I'm a bit gutted so I imagine some of you guys are a bit gutted from watching or not you know but yeah hopefully we'll get something sorted out we'll get it fixed and uh, I reckon for sure I can beat the record here because even then I don't even think I quite hit half throttle I was building it up I got there I got yeah I probably got about half throttle that's about it so there's so much more in this car so but yeah we'll see thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye all. Yeah, so it's fixed. What a disaster yesterday was. I am sorry guys. I am um, trying my best to beat that 50 mile an hour first before anyone else. But um, 45 mile an hour on my first little run was promising considering I got it to like half throttle and I had so much more power to give. But when I, I don't, I've got to work on my throttle control, I've got to work on trying to get this car to go straight. And eventually, I, I know for a fact I'm going to get over 50 mile an hour eventually. It's, it's, it's happening. But it's the fact that I'm inexperienced and I cannot put all these things together. But hopefully that will come with a bit of time. If I keep going and going and going, I'm going to learn a bit more. I'm going to become more experienced. I'm going to just generally, no, I'm going to learn a bit more and hopefully get that bit of experience. And that will then help me towards getting better speed runs but like I said I've just thrown myself in the deep end with this I've never done speed runs before I thought they were crap I'm now hooked and I absolutely love doing speed runs it's it's way more fun than I ever imagined I always looked at it and thought going up and down yeah whatever where's the fun in that but I did the same with crawling I thought crawling was crap and it's it's so technical it keeps you hooked and you're trying to get to the same line and do the same thing well it's the same with this as soon as you do one run, you're like, oh, I can better that. I can do that. If I, if I don't hit this line and I go, you know, a bit faster and I don't hit that bump that I just hit or something like that, you know, I could get an extra mile an hour. Well, this is the same. You literally want more and more and more. It gets addictive. So um, it's good for me that I've thrown myself in like this and I've done it with a budget car because if I'd have smashed up a, an infraction three times like this, I would have quit by now crying because it must kill you because it hurts my feelings when I crash this car to know that I've got to then rebuild it and then try and get it again and make it nice again. But if I did that with an infraction which is worth 10 times this, I'd be a bit, 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 bit gutted. So um, glad to be learning on something cheap and something so small. However, when I do come to get an infraction, which will happen one day, I definitely will be getting one. When I do do the speed runs and all that kind of thing, I'll have a bit of experience behind me, so I'll know a couple of things straight away, so it won't be just diving in and doing it. So it is good that I've done it with this, I think. And uh, a lot of people have enjoyed this so far. I'm just gutted that I've not got the top speed for you so far. But it is coming, I guarantee it, it's coming. I'm set, I'm addicted, and I'm bloody competitive, so. Subscribe if you haven't. Thanks for watching and I'll see you all later. Enjoy guys.